Uh, excuse. Yes. Good afternoon. Are you planning on uh, covering this in daily news, perhaps? I just wanted to ask if you could give us some more details on the cocoa sector and uh, exactly uh, what uh, will be happening in the cocoa sector. Thank you for that question. Miriam, please. Over to you. Yes, thank you for that question. So we are launching a dialogue between different stakeholders, both cocoa uh, producers from the Cote d'Ivoire and Ghana, for, as well as representatives of the uh, EP, member states, and civil society, to try and come up with a common approach to promote sustainability in the cocoa sector. And, you know, we tried to uh, launch a project for a minimum uh, income for cocoa producers. And following on from that, we wish to come up with measures such as those to fight deforestation and to prevent uh, child labour. Thank you. Um, the daily news will be coming out uh, very rapidly and you will also have more information in writing uh, there. So at this stage, I will invite you again to ask um, uh, questions to Miriam if you have any. I see that Odile's hand is still raised. So Odile, est-ce que tu as une question de suivi? Do you have a follow-up question, Odile, for Miriam? Or a question on another subject? Odile, you have the floor. Are you still with us? We oui, want. Yes, can you hear me? Thank you. Well, yes, I think there are presidential elections coming up in the Côte d'Ivoire. And the, the candidature of uh, the uh, president for a third term uh, has been an issue there. Now, uh, the timing of this project on cocoa and seeing as Côte d'Ivoire is the number one producer of cocoa in the world, I wanted to ask whether... Uh, you are also trying with this, the timing of this uh, project, to show that the European Union is doing something to try and uh, uh, protect the cocoa producers who are uh, exploited, do not have a minimum income, uh, etc. It's the timing that I find uh, interesting here, let's say. Uh, merci. Que tu yes, sir. thank you. Well, uh, the fact that you uh, find that timing interesting, uh, Odile, we are trying to protect uh, uh, cocoa producers, but also uh, producers in various other sectors across the world. And there is no link here with any political events in particular. This has long been one of the priorities of the European Union to uh, support sustainable production in various different sectors. Miriam, did you have anything to add? No, thank you. Uh, Thank you. Are there any other questions for Miriam at this stage? I can't see any hands raised. In that case, thank you, Miriam. are opening the floor for other questions, and now I see that Lawrence has his hand raised. So, Lawrence, go ahead. 